to access free topic sheets, worksheets, or to book an online class, visit ilearneasy.co.uk. In this video, we will learn about the solar system. The solar system is made up of many things, such as the sun, the moon, planets, comets, dwarf planets, and asteroids. There are eight planets in the solar system. The sun is a star, not a planet. It's at the centre of the solar system. The sun gives heat and light to all the planets. The planets are always in the same order from the sun. Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. An easy way to remember the order of the planets is My very easy method just speeds up naming. My is for Mercury, V is for Venus, E is for Earth, M is for Mars, J is for Jupiter, S is for Saturn, U is for Uranus and N is for Neptune. The Sun is much bigger than the planets and has a greater gravitational pull, so they can all move around the Sun in an elliptical path. All the planets take different amounts of time to orbit the Sun. For example, the Earth takes approximately 365 days to orbit the Sun fully. Planets further from the Sun will take longer to orbit. The Moon is not a planet, rather it's a small celestial body. This means a natural body of rock. The Earth's gravity keeps the Moon in orbit. The Moon takes approximately 28 days to orbit the Earth. Although the Moon looks bright, it doesn't actually produce light. It just reflects the light from the Sun. The Moon is spherical. However, when it's in different positions around the Earth, it looks like it's different shapes. The reason for this is because the Moon orbits the Earth. The Sun's rays illuminate the different parts of the Moon. The Earth is a planet that orbits the Sun. This is like all the other planets. While the Earth orbits the Sun, it also rotates around an imaginary line between the North and South Poles called an axis. It takes around 24 hours for the Earth to make a full turn on its axis. As the Earth rotates, the side facing the Sun receives warmth and light. This is the daytime. The side facing away from the Sun will be cooler and darker. This is the nighttime. The amount of time a place spends in the light and the dark usually changes throughout the year. Generally, daytimes are longer in the summer and shorter in the winter. The axis of the Earth is not vertical. It's slightly tilted. This impacts the seasons and the amount of daylight. As the Earth is continually rotating, the Sun appears to move across the sky. However, the Sun is actually stationary. At sunrise, some parts of the Earth are rotating towards the Sun. This makes it look like the sun is rising into the sky. At midday, the sun is at the highest point in the sky. At sunset, the same parts of the earth are rotating away from the sun. The sun appears to be going down. 